वेलकम यू ऑल राजा सिंगलिस क्लास एंड टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द जरन ओके व्हाट इज जरन जरन इज ए नाउन एंडिंग विथ आई एन जी दैट हैज मेड फ्रॉम ए वेर इट मस्ट बी ए वेर एंड वी हैव टू पुट और एड आई एन जी सो हैविंग बीन एडेड आई एन जी टू द वेर एंड यूज एज इट ए नाउन इज कॉल जरन ओके In basic form, it is a verb, and we have to put, we have to add ing, and used it as a noun. It is called gerund. A noun ending with ing that has made from a verb is gerund. For example, play. It is a verb, and I add here ing and make playing, and this is also verb ing form, but. When it is used as a noun, it is our gerund. Okay. Now there are four types of gerund: subject, direct object, object of preposition, and subject complement. First, subject. Playing is my hobby. Here. Playing is the subject, auxiliary verb, and my hobby. Playing is my hobby. In this sentence, the gerund used as subject. Okay. Now, direct object. And in gerund, it is used as direct object. everyone likes my playing everyone is the subject like is the verb my playing is the direct object or you can say this is the direct object when you change the voice my playing is liked by everyone so it is here my playing is the what here it has been used as direct object okay object of the preposition i was honored for my playing here the playing is the what having been added ing the word has been used as the object of the preposition i was honored for my play okay now subject complement subject complement my hobby is the subject and this playing is the complement this is the subject complement playing in the sentence my hobby is playing so here we use the gerund as a subject as a direct object as an object of preposition as a subject complement so it has been used four types so this is subject direct object object of preposition and subject complement so this is called gerund a noun ending with the ing that why has been made from a verb this is all about our gerund okay now before conclusion of my this session i would like to request you all please do subscribe my channel rajesh english class so that you can get many more items in relation to grammar as well as fun as well as some games in english okay thank you